Class Rock demonstrated the first motherboard with support for MXM. We Northeast were tired of repeating one simple truth. Platform Class SFX small form factor will only gain popularity in the future because it is much nicer and easier to deal with a small enclosure the size of a modern game console than with a huge tower ADX or even XLADX. If you are enthusiast, overclocker and your main goal is games, as well as either the use of PC, the compact solutions are ideal. But they're hard to fit a powerful graphics subsystem, and without it, modern games available. Passrock offers a unique new solution format micro SDX where the problem is solved, and quite unusual for a desktop PC way. Motherboard, more precisely, platform, Passrock Desk Mini GDX slash RX is interesting because it does not fit the standard form factor Mini SDX 55 in which to fit a powerful graphics just anywhere. Solution ass rack longer and it looks like it on the board mini ITX. Though Z270 MS DX MFSM is noticeably smaller. The chipset here is the reverse side of the PCB, and on the front we see only the socket LGA1151, a couple of slots DDR for SOD IMM and a fairly large connector to MFSM. It is the highlight of the new platform because in the format MFSM released the most powerful graphics solution, designed for notebooks with a modular design. Though versus the CPU socket of the power transistors of the voltage regulator of the CPU, some of them mounted and on the reverse side of the board, provided radiators for cooling. The system is compatible with all processors in LGA1151, even with the most powerful models with the index K. Chipset no cooling is allowed, but emit little heat. Apparently, it is expected that he will be in contact with metallic elements of the housing through heat conducting pads. If necessary, equip it with a simple radiator itself will be the owner of the new item. There, on the opposite side of the board we see for meter to socket, the top of which is intended for the installation of the wireless module WIFI and Bluetooth and the other three supports PCI X4 and install drives format 2260 and 2280. The storage subsystem data from this platform can be BERY productive when you install three drives, with support for NVMe and PCI Express RAID. The front part of the board has a standard format SDX a set of connectors. Ottawa Terminal and USB ports 3.1 Type and C. The ASRock claims to support Thunderbolt 3, but the board failed to notice any chips AS Media ASM 1142 slash ASM 2142 or Intel Alpine Ridge. Maybe it's a chip located in the bottom right corner of the board. In the back there is Gigabit Ethernet served by Intel i219V, to USB 3.0 ports, to HDMI ports, one of which supports the 2.0 standard, thanks to the chip MCDP2000, display port and mini DP, as well as port in round connector for external power supply. The specifications say that there are two SATA ports, but the standard connectors in the pictures are not visible. Probably, the seats are near the second and third connectors M2 on the reverse side of the board, is designed to display the SATA ports. Passrock offers the turnkey solution based on the platform desk mini GDX slash RX, which is enclosed in a branded case Passrock 2.7 liters, equipped with a processor Intel Core i7-7700K with the standard cooler NVDR for memory up to 16 GB with frequency up to 3200 MHz. Certainly possible to install 32 GB of memory, the benefit of the relevant SOD IMM modules are available on the market, for example, crucial CD 16G for FFD 8213, as the system storage offers Samsung 961 module with capacity of 128 GB and the graphics card module MFSM 3.0 Type-B, or Gavorce GDX 1060 or one of the AMD Radeon RX. External power supply has an output of 220 watts. In theory nothing prevents the use of more spacious housing, 
the module MF Femge Gorse GDX 1080 or Vega 10C connecting additional power supply standard MF Sem is designed for the transmission connector only 100 watts and more advanced and quiet cooling system CPU and along with the graphics adapter the idea of using standard MFSM video cards are VERY original and really allows you to create the gaming system in the dimensions of the console Sony or Microsoft, but with much more powerful graphics subsystem. Of advantages consoles have there is that ease of use by untrained user. I should say that the idea of using MFSM modules outside their main ecological niches is not new. The number of attempts have been made previously. The project there was a dual processor graphics card based on the basis of a couple of MXM modules, but in the series, this design did not go. There are adapters that allow to use the MXM modules in PC by Express, but is really worthwhile decisions can be called a new ASU CS5110, the larger the system, similar to that described in this article and also using the MXM slot. There are specific boards is not too well known as manufacturer lean tech. The latter can serve as a great basis for a H tier PC, but designed for the use of mobile processors and have the form factor mini ITX, which means that they are also larger than a new ASRock 